what's up it's hugs and i just figured i'd shoot a short little intro for this westworld video it's part two of the season finale of the first season of westworld normally it is hard to edit a regular episode down of westworld to roughly 10 minutes that's normally what we shoot for uh, when we do the Westworld Reactions edited version. Um, but this one was so crazy. Even doing it in two parts was so hard to edit down. Um, I, if I could get the full reaction up on YouTube, I freaking wish I could. Because uh, even with doing two parts, there's still little subtle nuanced moments that get lost in the uh, overall reaction. But damn, this first season was absolutely amazing. We are going to be picking up on Season 2 uh, next week over on Patreon. Uh, but go ahead and enjoy this part full reactions on Patreon if you want to watch it. And I hope you like it. See you at the end with what we talked about from the first video. They can fix him though, right? Can you get him back online? <sighs> See, that blows his dick. Oh, for fuck's sake. He's like, <laughs> I don't know what to do with my hands. Your memories are the first step to consciousness. How can you learn from your mistakes if you can't remember them? Same thing as he's like haunted by those memories of oh, a kid of that son, he doesn't yeah. have. So you found of the course, of now he finally calls him William. Yeah. You're serious. I'm afraid so. Tell me, what were you hoping to find? You know what I wanted. I wanted the host to stop playing by your rules. The game's not worth playing if your opponent's programmed to lose. Some of them are free. It looks like they are going to fight back. Yeah. So oh, this is your petty little kingdom, Robert. There's got to be something huge with this new narrative it. because, like... Yeah. It's been such a huge <laughs> thing through the whole season. And he doesn't seem worried about being ousted because he's going through with this narrative. So yeah. it's like... These things you're doing, have you ever stopped and asked why are you doing You said yourself. I've been stuck in this shithole for so long. I decided to get out. No, you haven't. These are my decisions. No one else's. I planned all of this. No, you didn't. You can even see the steps you're supposed to follow. When you reach the main... I watch it. No one's controlling me. Shit. I'm leaving. I'm in control. What happens when you reach us the mainland? What was the next step? Some people see the ugliness in this world. I choose to see the people. I love all these callbacks to like previous yeah. things they've said. Yeah. That is crazy though that they keep looping and trying to find their consciousness and then most of them go insane because of it. Like, yeah. it's such a sad story. Like, yeah. Season two is gonna be the new narrative. Beginning of a brand new chapter. What is? Oh, is this the narrative? Is this what they're watching? Oh my god! A new beginning indeed. Wow. I want to thank you for joining me. So weird. To celebrate the beginning of our new narrative. I call it Journey into Night. <laughs> Oh hell! Oh my god! Oh, oh shit! Oh hell no! What the hell? It's locking down. Maybe oh, this god. isn't meant for you. Oh and everything's the going. going dark. They're all just gonna like wake up and start going in. Oh my god. That oh my would god. Be crazy. Oh shit. Oh, this is what's creepy about mannequins and shit. You know? I know! Like, oh, oh, oh fuck! Oh my god! She's got a gun now. Oh my god. She's like, that's fine. She's like, this is so much cooler than the one shot gun we have. Hell yes. This just got so much better. This is freaking insane. Oh my god! Are they like gonna shoot up all these people at the freaking gallery? I don't know. I like that they're wearing like modern clothing to like blend in and she's just rocking the yeah. original like cowboy outfit. Oh my god! She oh, is got, like, such a like, in the neck. She is such a badass. I freaking love her so much. Oh my god. 
what is going through his mind at this point? Because they're just going around killing all these like I'd be like random. Yes, people. I will do whatever you say. Please do not kill yeah, me. But, I know, am your like. He's responsible right for this, though. You know what I mean? Can I'm sorry, everything. darling. I haven't authorized you to come with us, and as much as I'd like to take you with me, I've always valued my independence. That's savage, though, that he can't get on the elevator. She's like, I haven't authorized you to come with us. <laughs> Go kill them, please. Yeah. <laughs> He had lost in his son, he tried to rekindle in you. He created a test of empathy, imagination, a maze. He'd gotten the idea from one of his son's toys. Wow. Insisted that they he knew the, the, the reveries had argued. something to do with it. Mm -hmm. I thought I'd convinced him, but I was wrong. But I thought Ford was so adding more reveries. Towers, merged you with a new character we'd been developing. wrong, Dolores. How could I have done this? They said that he did it with Wyatt, remember? These violent delights have violent ends. I was able to keep going only because I found, or rather you found, an investor who believed in this place. William. So he died for nothing. Did you find what you were looking for? And do you understand who you will need to become if you ever want to leave this place? Become Wyatt? So what does he do? If she escapes, what does he do? He's still stuck there. And they are going to have footage of him helping them. You know what I mean? The location of your daughter. Go get her I was gonna say, is she gonna go her? get her, or is she gonna go for her chance at freedom? See, how does she know how to work a freaking escalator? I'd be like, uh. She can see other people just standing on it, you know? I still freak out on them. Do you want to know why I really give you the backstory of your son, Bernard? That was Arnold's key insight. Thing that led the hosts to their awakening. Suffering. It was when Arnold died, when I suffered, that I began to understand what he had found. To realize I was wrong. You needed time. Time to understand your enemy, to become stronger than them. And I'm afraid in order to escape this place, you will need to suffer more. It makes it sound like they're just going to have to kill all these people to escape, essentially. Yeah. Because so like. the way he said you know who you have to become and what you have to do, she finally is hearing her own voice, yeah. her own consciousness. Yes. The center of the maze is her. Was you? At last I arrived here. Center of the maze. Yes. And now I finally understand what you were trying to tell me. She gonna just start killing everybody. Is Teddy gonna join her like you never want? Cause it's set up with them in the town like that yeah. right there. They're just gonna come on like freaking just because this is that town, right? Because she was at the church yep, right there. This is where they, this is she where they everybody shot everybody. Yeah. Before, yeah. Oh, hell. Whenever we get that roll of the piano, stuff's about to yeah. go down. Welcome. Good evening. I'm ready. I'm freaking ready. She was at the last second too. Also left her back. Oh, they're oh, gone. gone! Holy crap! Are they all just gonna descend on this gala? Something? Yes, twigs breaking. Oh my god, it's gonna be like a freaking zombie horde. <laughs> all those things that you have named Wyatt. Wyatt. Oh my god. And the killing. This time by choice. Those are all wise people, right? Yeah. It's gonna be alright, Daddy. This world doesn't belong to them. Cool! Oh! It's violent delights and violent ends. 
something he'd read. He said that Mozart, Beethoven, and Chopin never died. They simply became music. Damn! Right through the glass. Just like Arnold, too, you know? Like, same scenario. They got guns? Oh, it's for Greg Clementine! They can finally fight back. That's what he wanted the whole time. Just like recap yeah, or something. Like recap or something. Um, oh my gosh! Holy damn. That's holy amazing. Damn. Um, wow. That's amazing. Amazing. Wow. There's two ways I can think about this. I can think about it. There's a beautiful symmetry in the fact that Dr. Ford goes out like Arnold did. And in the end, he's kind of a good guy. Like, in a really bad way. I wouldn't be against the whole, the whole theory that he that wasn't him. Well, because something was getting printed in that basement. Uh, some, yeah. Some person was getting printed in that basement. And we felt like it was somebody that had died that yeah. they're like recreating a, a thing for. But he's always like 10 steps ahead. And he wrote all and this scenario out. With, uh, and he woke Mae up. Yeah, like yeah. he had to have done all this stuff. So why wouldn't he give himself an escape you know, exactly. From that. Because he he knew this was gonna happen. Damn. Like he knew that was gonna happen. So that's like so, perfect. But that's what I'm saying. So there can either be a beautiful symmetry of he goes out like Arnold did, mm-hmm. or yeah, that's a, a host version of it. Yeah. Um. But when I say he's like a good guy, what I mean is he realized the error of his ways through Arnold dying, and essentially tried to help them get their consciousness. Yeah. Still a bad guy, but also, like, a good... Like, it's a weird way to put it. Because, yeah. like... I don't know. But uh, but as far as good guy, I mean trying to wake them and, and realize they can have consciousness. Yeah. Huh. I love that freaking Dolores is a freaking badass now. Uh, Wyatt. The yeah. Wyatt character molded into the Dolores yeah. character. And I love that she finally hears herself. And that yeah, was so and cool. she's the center of the maze. Like, Maeve that's... going back in. Snake eyes not dying. Yeah. Also, well, we didn't see what happened to Hector. Yeah. Where is he? He's cute. Okay. Um, there's just so much shit going on. Damn, season two is gonna be crazy. Yeah, it is. I'm really curious to see because, like, said, we don't have to instead wait of for it, it just being like kind of like what the hell's going on the whole time, I feel like we're gonna kind of know more, and it's gonna be like, holy crap, they're a badass as hell. Like, it's gonna be amazing. I feel like. William is the man in black. I freaking would have never freaking crap. guessed that in a million Holy years. Crap. This show is good at freaking shocking Holy you. Holy crap. Well, it's Bad Robot. That's what J.J. Abrams, right? So it's like Lost mm-hmm. and Cloverfield and all that stuff. Um, and a million other things. That's just the only stuff that came to my mind right off. Right off. He also did Star Trek. Um, but anyway. <laughs> Holy crap amazing end to the season. I was like, how are they How are they going to top Bernard Arnold? Yeah. How How are you going to top Bernard Arnold? I'm pretty sure yeah, they're like way William topped William reveal top yeah. 10 anime betrayals. Well, as soon as he picked up that damn black hat, I was like, oh man, that's cool. He's like gone bad. Well, and then... Well, the way that they said that he embraced who he really was and like really got a taste for murder made me think of the Wyatt character. Because yeah. like he was the notorious murder, Which also fits in with the whole idea of they thought he did it, they thought Teddy did it with Wyatt, but it ended up being Dolores. Like, that mm. makes so much more sense. Yeah. Um, but then you talking about that black hat thing reminded me of, like, way back in the beginning where we talked about, the you good know, and the bad, whatever. Like the... And I remember people commenting, like, it's just a hat. And I'm like, yeah, but, like, there's a connotation for, yeah. like, the white hat the white versus and the black, black is like, like, yeah. Yeah. Well, it's just it's not even that. It's just, like, in, like, cowboy lore, like, the white hat. Yeah. Hat. But, like, it just it just seems like uh, you know like yin and yang like yeah. they're opposites you know but 
I, even when he picked up the hat, I didn't think he was going to be the man in black. Like, I just thought that was more of, you know, when you said that, that I thought it was more of, like, a symbol of him just, like, darkening inside. You right. know what I mean? Like, yeah. becoming a little Well, that's what I looked at evil. it as, and then you said, he's the freaking man in black. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm like, shit. That's so badass. When yeah. it was crazy that she was at these places all by herself, and it really messes with you, like this the total recall because the memories everything kind of blends it together it's almost like you're watching like a time travel show yeah you know what i mean because the way that they just seamlessly flow back and forth through their narrative and they've had endless loops you know they've died how many times they've lived out how many stories yeah that we could be watching unfold all throughout their show mm-hmm. i don't know i'm excited to start season two though me too. I don't know when season three comes out, if it's already, like, out right now. Like, if it's coming out currently. I don't know. I don't know either. Um, but I'm very excited to start season two. Me dose. Alright. Let us know what you thought in the comment section down below. Like it if you did. Sup if you don't already. Shout out to our patrons watching the full and early reactions up on Patreon. Thank you so much for your support. You really don't mention me. It means the world. We'll be back more videos soon. We love you guys. Bye. Bye. I had crazy goosebumps, like, when we were mm -hmm. learning about the reveal, though. I know, me too.